everyone and welcome back to Caroline Brown's Movie Reactions. Thank you so much for joining me for another great movie today. We're going to be watching Alias, Aliens, which is the sequel to Alien. Very excited to get to jump in to the second Aliens movie. The first one was very exciting and interesting too because I had a little alien of my own inside me which made it even creepier. So yes, I was pregnant at the time. So here we go. Let's watch Aliens. Oh, this is the old ship, is it? Yeah, I think it is the old ship. Because remember, she escaped with that pod. Oh, never mind. Or if that's the ship that she escaped with. Bio readouts are all on the green. Looks like she's alive. Ah, uh, there goes our salvage, guys. I wonder how long it took for her to escape to the time that she was like found, or like how long was she in that little cocoon for? How long was I out there? Okay. It's just that uh, this might be a shock to you. How long? Five years? 57 years. What? You had drifted right through the core systems, and it's really just blind luck that a deep salvage team found you when they did. It's one in a thousand, really. One in a thousand. But she didn't age or anything? Is she having a heart attack? It was a dream, it was a dream. Where is she now? Oh, it's a green room. To make you feel like you're outside, but you're not really outside. Is there any word about my daughter? I really think we should worry about the hearing now, because we don't have a lot of time. You know, you've got feds and interstellar commerce commission dying. She really you know, doesn't have care any about, news that. about my daughter. I was hoping to wait until after the inquest. What happened to her kid? Amanda Ripley McLaren, age 66. And that was at the time of her death. Oh no. Two years ago. Wow. I promised her that I'd be home for her birthday. Oh, it's crazy though. She doesn't even look like she's aged at all for 57 years if it's supposedly that. Let's see if we can't get a closer look at this thing. Maybe through that crack down the side. Shouldn't we call in? Let's wait till we know what to call it in as. Oh, you bring your kids out there? I don't know. I think that's kind of sketch. Should we take a look inside? Do they leave the kids behind? You can stick inside. I mean it. Oh, they're actually able to breathe without assistance. I wonder what kind, like how it would be up there. If it's like living in a dark planet like this, like do they ever get sunlight? No, because like they're in the middle of nowhere, like far deep into space. I feel like those kids look worried. <laughs> Means we remember the first one. Well, smoking indoors is definitely still a thing back then, anyway. Ripley, we have to talk. We've lost contact with the colony on LV 426. You guys throw me at the wolves, and now you want me to go back out there? I can guarantee your safety. What would you say if I told you I could get you reinstated as a flight officer? If I go. Well, yeah, if you go. Come on, that's a second chance, kiddo. Why is he calling her kiddo? She's older than he is. Just think about it. Thanks for the coffee. Would the cat be going too? <laughs> Maybe going back up would help her anxiety in some ways, like face your fears. And I know that's not right for everybody, but... What is that, some kind of calling card? Hello. Just tell me one thing, Burke. You're going out there to destroy them, not to study. That's the plan. You have my word on it. Mmm, I feel like he's lying. All right, I'm in. Are you? I think that... Serious, girl? And you, you little shithead, you're staying here. Poor cat doesn't get to go on the fun trip. Or the not-so-fun trip, I'm assuming, is gonna be. We got firepower. Lots of it, too. It kind of feels like the first movie a little bit, like with the same style of a slow build up to what ended up being like super crazy. Ooh, those are the army boys. <coughs> All right, sweethearts, what are you waiting for? Breakfast in bed? Another glorious day in the core. But like, how come like they don't grow beards and stuff? Like how she didn't age? 
Have you ever been mistaken for a man? No. Have you? <laughs> do the thing with the oh, knife. Please. Oh, please. Come on, man. Come on, man. No, don't do it. Yeah, you. Hey, come on, come messing around. Don't come move. On. Trust me. Oh. <laughs> I feel the same way if that happened to me. Enjoy your meal. That wasn't funny, man. <laughs> You never said anything about an android being on board. Why not? Is there a problem? Ripley's last trip out, the, the artificial person malfunctioned. Malfunctioned? There were problems, and uh, a few deaths were involved. It is impossible for me to harm, or by a mission of action, allow to be harmed a human being. Hmm. Just stay away from me, Bishop. You got that straight? I guess you don't like the cornbread, either. But PTSD, or residual fear and frustration, is definitely going to come out in this movie, for sure. Especially, very different storyline, obviously, but very similar in the same way. Boom, boom, boom. Get prepped, ready, set. <laughs> they look like besties. Hudson! Get on the ready line, Marine! Get down the door! But she doesn't have to go, right? Hut two, hut two, hut two! Move, move, move! <laughs> I'm kidding. All right, I want combat seating. You know your places. Oh, she is going. I thought she was going to stay on the main ship. Lock them in, Hudson. Reminds me of like a roller coaster type of strap. 240, nominal to profile. We're in the pipe. Five by five. That would definitely scare me if this was a roller coaster ride. Like, or airplane. Yeah, yeah, it would definitely freak me out. Are they getting close to the actual, like, landing? Just like they're coming in so fast. Check your camera. There seems to be a malfunction. That's better. When something's broken, just smack it a couple times and usually it gets better. Like those old tube TVs. That's the atmosphere processor. Yep, that's it. Completely automated. You know, we manufacture those, by the way. Do you now? And here they go. I wonder if the alien's gonna affect the machinery that makes the air breathable. Like the first movie, my heart started beating right around this part in the movie, I think. Like, right around this time, it's like they haven't seen an alien yet. We haven't really been caught off guard or by surprise, so... Oh no. It really looked like it did a number on the space station. Nothing. Not a goddamn thing. Reminds me of Ghostbusters, too. So many, like different movies you kind of pick up in other movies and depending on which order you saw certain movies even though this is uh this might have come out before another movie but it still reminds you of things because movies are obviously inspired by other movies i think Ooh, what are they gonna find oh little hamsters you're gonna love this what Ew. This place is dead. Whatever happened here, I think we've missed it. All right, the area is secured. Let's go in and see what the computer can tell us. It's not secure. The area is secured, Ripley. But Ripley's right. It's not really secured. They went around once, couldn't find anybody, but where did they go? And now they expect those guys to go in? Okay, let's go. Come on, Ripley, you can do it. Must have been a hell of a fight. Looks that way. She's the only one that seems to be really on edge. Like, they should all be on edge right now. No bodies and nothing else to come by? <gasps> what is that? Are those the aliens? Did they come in and put themselves in? Or were, was the colony growing them? What are they? Careful, Burke. <gasps> oh, I had a feeling that was gonna happen. Hey, Palm, where are your people? Anybody in D-Block? Oh, uh, that's a negative. We're all in operation. She should have a gun too. Or a knife or something to protect herself. So gonna be another like cat or character. <gasps> I did not mean to jump on that one. Per like it just got me nervous. It should it should be right there. Is it beneath them? Over them? <gasps> what was it? Oh, it's a little girl. It's the little girl. Easy, easy. I got her. Ow! <gasps> Damn. Does she have an alien inside? Wait. How long has she been there by herself? Easy. Oh. Second grade citizenship award. 
What's her name again? Rebecca. Now think, Rebecca. Where are your parents? That's not a way to talk to a kid that's been traumatized. Physically, she's okay. Come on, we're wasting our time. You have to be nurturing with kids like that. Look how traumatized she is. Hard to believe there's a little girl under all this. And a pretty one, too. Aww. You don't talk much, do you? I think she's been literally traumatized to the point that she can't talk. My name's Newt. Nobody calls me Rebecca except my brother. Hmm. Newt. I like that. I'm Ripley. And who is this? Casey. Aww. Hello, Casey. Probably getting some interference from the structure. With those lights. Uh-oh. Roger, that's a 216. Oh, no. What is that? It looks like a nest. Proceed inside. I'd really proceed with caution. It looks like an ant's nest almost, like with tunnels and Kate, like burrows and things like that. Like the. Watch your fire and check your targets. Remember, we're looking for civvies in here. I don't think they'll find anybody else alive, though. I think she, the kid's gonna be the only one. If they fire their weapons in there, won't they rupture the cooling oh, system? Oh, look, this whole station is basically a big fusion reactor. She's talking about a thermonuclear explosion and adios muchachos. Oh, great. Adios muchachos. Flame units only. I want rifles slung. Sir, I... Just do it, Sergeant. And no grenades. Is somebody gonna keep it in their pocket? I want it now. <laughs> Give it up. Right on, Vaz. I knew one of them was gonna be stupid. They should have told him why they can't fire. Oh, no. There's one. That's the alien's carcass. Aww. You're gonna be all right. You're gonna be all right. Please don't kill me. Multiple signals. They're closing. They're all gonna die. They're all around us, man. Jesus. But what's gonna come out? Here. <laughs> Oh. Oh no. Talk to me, Apollon! And you guys all made fun of her. Ripley, what the hell are you doing? She's going in? Come on, let's move them! Get out, get out, get out! No, 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 stay! Don't go, don't go! Back it up, back it up! Come on, he's down! I say we take off and nuke the entire site from orbit. This installation has a substantial dollar value. No, 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 no. They can bill me. I'm not blind to what's going on, but I cannot authorize that kind of action. I'm sorry. Well, you're not our boss. Well, I believe Corporal Hicks has authority here. Yes, he does. I say we take off, nuke the site from orbit. Yes. Oh, look at the teeth. Incoming. Incoming! It's game over, man. It's game over. What the fuck are we gonna do now? Like, the kid's not freaking out. We better get back, because it'll be dark soon, and they mostly come at night. Mostly. They're gonna lock themselves in a room in the area. How long after we're declared overdue can we expect a rescue? 17 days. Oh! <laughs> Hudson, just deal with it because we need you and I'm sick of your bullshit. Now I want you to get on a terminal and call up some kind of floor plan. Anything that shows the layout of this place. Are you listening? Yeah. He just needs to focus on task. I'll be in med lab. Check on Gorman. Continue my analysis. You do that. She doesn't want to be anywhere near him. Get in. Scoot down. That's good. Oh, yeah. she probably hasn't been in a, be a bed with a blanket in forever. Don't go, please. Newt, I'm gonna be right in the next room. And you see that camera right up there? I can see you right through that camera. I would want, if I was that 11 year old, I'd definitely want her to stay. An hour to patch it and line the antenna, and about 50 minutes flight time. Watch your fingers. Oh, that's claustrophobic. Can the aliens sense though where there's like body heat 
or motion somehow. Oh, rise and shine. Look, Ripley, I just forget want... it. Excuse me. Is she gonna go check on Newt? Oh no, where did she go? Is she wearing the watch under the bed? Oh, she feels safer. That's where they're gonna sleep. I hope this synthetic guy isn't like the one from the first movie. What's interesting about both of these movies is that it's a very slow lead up. Like there's there's some intense moments, but a lot of it is just like, like is something gonna happen? Is something not gonna happen? Is something gonna happen? Is something not gonna happen? Uh oh. Oh no. Is the gun gone? <gasps> run, 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 run. Hey! Auto refuel mode and a sequencing right. Oh my god. You freaking turd. You're an a hole. Oh no. You're such a turd. Like a kid's there. What is she gonna do? It's the med lab. Go, go, go. Ripley, you're smart for doing that. No, 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 no. Newt, help her, help her, Newt. Come on. Come on, come on, get it off, get it off. Oh. Aw. All right, we waste him. No offense. No! He's gotta go back. Why? Oh. I just want Newt to survive. Well, I want them all to survive, really, but mainly Newt, you know? Movement. They found a way in. Something we missed. But how did they get through? Five meters, man. Four. Where is it? What the hell? They're above. They're just falling like when you say raining cats and dogs. Well, that's really raining aliens. Go, go, go. You freaking turd. Oh, he's trigger happy right now. Oh, oh no. Oh no. He's gone, he's gone. Run, 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 run. I think Chica is gonna get are the aliens actually in the duck? Out there, there's a shark cut across the roof. Oh no. Kill her, right? She's just a kiddo. Newt! Ripley! She seems to have a little bit of an accent. Now don't move. Stay very still. Okay. Can they swim? Kids. I know. Hurry! I know! I mean it! Oh, he's doing as best as he can. Newt! <gasps> oh no! Oh no! 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 Is she gonna survive? But are they leaving Newt behind? Or did she actually die? How much time? 26 minutes. We're not leaving. They're gonna try and save Newt. Yeah. Is she having to go do this solo? Or is Higgs gonna be able to be there with her? See you, Higgs. It's Dwayne. Dwayne. Ellen. Don't be gone long, Alan. There's a vibe between the two of them. I feel like that's a de it's a death trap. And I've been really surprised with some movies that I've watched. Like I was I was shocked that she was the only one who survived the last movie. She looks so badass with like all the smoke coming out and everything. What's gonna happen? What I was saying before is like some movies have surprised me and the main character actually dies or it's not the ending that I thought it was gonna be. And so I'm really hoping that all four of them get off, including the synthetic. 
Where is she? No. She's dead. No, she's alive. It's gonna be non-stop. Don't make a sound, Newt. Where's the head? Is this the end? Reminds me a little bit of a T-Rex. Is that all her baby eggs? Go, Ripley, go! You're gonna run out of, of ammunition! Oh, look at all the eggs come out. I love how this 11 year, or this kid, sorry, not 11 year old, was an integral part of the success of this uh, like mission. I'm hoping that this is a good sign that she is gonna survive it. How do they even know that, like, how does she even know like the way around? I was so wrong, I think they might die. Does she have any ammo left or anything? Hit the button new to go up. Is it the alien? <gasps> get out, get out, get out. Is there something wrong with the ship? It's okay, we're okay. Say thank you, Bishop. Yeah. Mama bear power. I had to circle and hope that Aww. things didn't get too rough to take you off. Bishop, you did okay. You did more than okay. <gasps> oh no. No, 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 no. Oh my god, how did it come? It's very monster. Is Hicks safe on the ship? <laughs> I was not expecting that. Get away from her, you bitch. That's what I called her. Oh. I'm trying really hard, guys, not to close my eyes. Oh, smart, Ellen. Oh, no. Oh yeah, not Wrigley, Ripley. I kept saying Wrigley, sorry. No! I knew it, I knew it! No, 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 no! Hold on, hold on, let her take your shoe! Let the bitch just pull your shoe off! Bye bye! Like, I understand she played a motherly role in this thing, but she didn't lose her actual mom. I just think it's difficult for that. But, of course, they are now mother-daughter. I'm just surprised that she said mommy and not Rip. Are we going to sleep all the way home? All the way home. Can I dream? Yes, honey. I think we both can. Hmm. <laughs> She's a strong cookie though. Like a really strong cookie. Well guys, that was Alien. So that was the sequel to Alien. I hope you liked my reaction. If you want to see the full length reaction, you can head on over to Patreon where early access is always available for movies and shows. I think it was great. Like if I had to rate it, I think I liked it better than the first Aliens. There was more action. It wasn't as slow. There was more jump scenes. There was more um, like characters involved. And I love the relationship that was built between Ripley and Newt Hicks and then you have Bishop and I like how Bishop the synthetic was not evil this time at all the fact that 
the queen bee alien died what would happen with sequels to alien and aliens can't wait to watch the next one make sure to give it a thumbs up for this video and subscribe if you haven't done so already i'll see you guys all next time bye